Christian Bale is the type of actor who totally commits to a role. To play Dick Cheney in the biopic Vice, he completely shaved his head and eyebrows. A move the actor said helped him dive right into the role. You work hard for it. I can, I can uh, play Santa. <laughs> when Christian Bale was cast as Dick Cheney in the Adam McKay directed biopic Vice, a lot of people were skeptical. How could the Batman actor pass as the former vice president? Luckily, Christian Bale was more than ready to completely transform himself physically. In an interview with Yahoo Entertainment, the actor joked that, now and then I like to shave my head, bleach my eyebrows, and put on 40 pounds. He explained that he shaved his head to play Dick Cheney because it helped him become a blank canvas through which these incredible artists could create the various ages of Cheney. Christian said that every day on set, his head would be shaven and his eyebrows would be bleached and plucked. Christian Bale told GQ that the team on the 2018 biopic spent months working with him to get his physical transformation exactly right. He said that usually movies don't allow special effects artists that much time to prep, but Vice was a special exception. No way, we've got to have months and months and months to get anywhere close to something that can work here because it's, it's the movement. The prosthetics and makeup artists created over a hundred pieces of encapsulated silicone to help the actor fully transform into Dick Cheney at five different stages in his life. Christian says the process took a lot of hard work and patience on everyone's part. Makeup artist Greg Canham told the LA Times that at first, the aim was to have some Cheney in there, but have it where you can still see Christian. Greg eventually decided that the idea was no fun, so he just proceeded with what I wanted to do, which turned into full makeup. Yep, they made him up full Cheney. Let's make sure those uh, phone lines are working. When filming started, Greg Cameron said the makeup design team worked with Christian Bale for three hours every morning to reshape the actor's face into the former vice president. The makeup expert says they started by shaving Christian's head very closely. Then they'd use a special kit of Mel Pax paint to color his head so the black roots of his hair wouldn't show through. Then the team added silicone appliances to act as as skin. They were glued onto Christian's neck, cheeks, and nose. The thickness of the pieces depended on Dick Cheney's age throughout the movie. The transformation was so impressive that many people and media outlets didn't believe the actor was Christian Bale when images leaked from the set. Idea is to win. Christian Bale is no stranger to transforming his body for roles, especially his weight. In 2004, he dropped 40 pounds for his critically lauded performance in The McKinnist. His character was an anorexic, insomniac, factory worker, and during filming, he whittled his body down to 120 pounds. On the other end of the spectrum, Christian bulked up to 220 pounds to play Batman in 2008's The Dark Knight. And he gained a lot of weight for his performance in 2013's American and hustle. In an interview, Christian Bale said he never sought medical advice on how to gain and lose weight for roles, but he says that decision eventually caught up with him. So, for Vice, he decided that maybe somebody knows better than I do. And I am fine with it. So he went to a professional and they helped him gain 40 pounds in a healthier way. Christian says his secret to putting on the pounds? Lots and lots of pie. Yum. Christian told GQ that he probably went a little too far when he got down to 120 pounds in the machinist. And his friends and family didn't particularly enjoy his behavior during filming. He said that once he raps on a particularly challenging movie, it can be a difficult long process to find your normal self again. The year after Vice's release, Christian told E! News that he was likely done with his dramatic body transformations. And I feel like if I keep doing what I've done in the past, I'm gonna die. Probably a good idea. It looks like Christian Bale's drastic transformation paid off. His performance as Dick Cheney won a Golden Globe for Best Actor and won an Oscar for Best Makeup and Hairstyling.